do I begin? Netflix recently dropped, uh, it's not recent. I, I've been, you know, not interested in watching it because it's totally all bullshit. But anyway, I finally took the time in my somewhat busy schedule and watched it. It's called The Beautiful Game. Basically, it's a football film where a bunch of homeless guys play in a tournament called the World Homeless World Cup, which is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard in my entire life. Like, that's the dumbest shit ever. It's quite similar to another thing I've heard, uh, I, I, I film I saw, was it a show, I'm not convincingly sure, called uh, the Refugee World Cup. Also bullshit. Also the most rubbish thing I've ever seen. Like, this is like a, a past job uh, of first world country bullshit. And I, I was very disappointed when I saw African countries in this. I was like, what the hell is this? I'm glad I didn't see it in my country. I'm glad I didn't see my country. And during the movie, uh, there was a problem with South Africa not going to the competition. I was very happy about that. I thought they were not going to do this embarrassing bullshit thing. But they did it. They did it. And they won the whole thing, which is great for them. But the most embarrassing thing. And, and I just thought it was just a film. But then I realized it's an actual thing. It's an actual event that started in 2001. There's an actual event where a bunch of homeless guys get the irony board planes to go to a certain country in another place from where they from to play world cup football and <laughs> so you're telling me we have homeless people who are great at football don't get me wrong that's great you're telling me instead of their government instead of their nation instead of them or the competition hosts whoever is sponsoring this goddamn thing instead of building these guys homes and finding them jobs they'd rather spend money by putting them on a fucking plane across the world to play a stupid competition pay expensive hotel rooms hey don't get me wrong they were bunking a room they were sharing a room it's still a hotel and somebody still paid for it somebody still paid for their food some paid for their travel someone paid or something paid for their uniforms those are fact someone paid for the organizers you can't tell me the referees uh the security, everybody's working this shit for free. Nope, you can't tell me that. So all that money spent organizing the damn shit could have spent buying, building trailer parks for them, building a home for them. I don't know, renting a home for a fucking year. You don't know how much a flight costs for you to move from South Africa to Italy, for you to move from America to Italy, for you to move from Japan. The fucking Italy. For you to move from anywhere in the fucking world except in Europe. The fucking Italy. Even boarding a plane from England. The fucking England. The fucking Italy costs money. Instead of these countries solving these problems like a normal country in two season would, by getting these people jobs, by providing proper shelter and housing for them, they organize a stupid competition. Let them play football. Organize silly little medals and do the most unrealistic thing I've ever seen. I get it. The guys are horrible. You're telling me men and women play on the same pitch and no one's getting injured. I wish I had a camera on this angle because you would have seen. I would have been like, let me just show you. I'm looking there, just talking and talking, and then I'll be like, if I had a camera there. I bet you get a secondary camera. Definitely. <sighs> anyway, I would not recommend you watch this. It's the most bullshit thing I've ever seen in my entire life. It's like putting a band-aid on a bullet wound and expecting it to fucking heal. Because it's cheerful. Yes, it's a lot of negativity. Because I'm very disappointed. I'm very disappointed in Netflix for putting this shit together. They did a documentary, maybe, but the fact that they put everything together, it's sad. Very sad. Horrible, in fact. Yep. I don't know what more you want me to say. Like, this is the most disappointing shit ever. I mean, I spend an hour plus so much of that garbage. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Remember to hit that like and sub button. I'm not in the mood because that was bullshit. That was really bullshit. 
I don't believe this shit. Now that was entertaining. Please let us hang out yet another time. Remember to like and subscribe. Adios, folks. Adios.